This is just a short video to give a preview of something new. Some of my previous videos covered AI techniques for humanoid non-player characters in Unity using navigation meshes, waypoints, and things like that. This is now an attempt to have a non-player character or NPC driven by a neural network trained using deep reinforcement learning with the Unity ML Agents package. The humanoid agent is trying to catch the dog. The dog wanders around using a navigation mesh and waypoints, and the agent's brain is a neural network. These four windows show different views. One camera follows the dog, another camera follows the human. This map shows a blue dot for the human and a green dot for the dog. And here we have a side view of the environment. The action is running at 20 times normal speed. This view is showing eight identical environments running in parallel. The human is pretty good at finding the dog, especially when there is a straight line of sight between them. When a house is in the way, the dog and the human both tend to wander until there is a direct line of sight. Let's slow down the action from 20x. Here we are running at 10x, now 5x, and now real time. The neural net driven human moves in kind of a herky jerky way, but I think we can fix that by changing to a slightly different approach. So, was this approach successful? In some ways, yes, but I also found some limitations to the neural net approach and some tricks for getting it to work better. What you see here was the result of more than 20 different experiments. So the neural network deep learning approach is not straightforward. I haven't found any documentation on applying deep reinforcement learning to humanoid characters in Unity, so this is new ground. I will make some more videos going into the details and make some recommendations along the way for what works well. Please subscribe if you are interested in seeing those videos as I make them. And if any of you are experts in deep reinforcement learning or the Unity ML Agents Toolkit, please add comments with your own insights. I'd love to hear your ideas and comments as we work through this.